guys, what's up? It's Monica and welcome back to another outfit of the day, Everyday Style with me. Today I do have makeup on because I literally just finished shooting. My office is a mess, it's a disaster. But I'm running out to actually go pick up a new car. I got a new car, yay. I'll share that in a vlog, so stay tuned. But yes, I'm going to pick up my car, so I was just like, okay, what can I put on real quick? So I'm wearing this beautiful blazer which and everything else, and I'm gonna flip it around and share it with you. But this is your first time, my name is Monica, <laughs> and this series is really everyday style, what I'm wearing at home, while I work from home, while I run errands, while I just, you know, do my thing as a fashion and lifestyle blogger. So um, the outfits are very realistic, very comfortable, easy to wear, and easy to recreate. So that's what the series is about. So if you're into that, make sure you subscribe, hit that notification bell so you never miss a video from the series. Um, what else? Also make sure you check me out on Instagram because I do post every week quite frequently i won't say daily but pretty often so follow me on instagram it's odd by Moni, and tiktok and my website and all that good stuff it's odd by monica or odd by money across the board so anywho i'm gonna flip it around share the look so i can run out of here <laughs> i'm wearing this beautiful green linen blazer it is from j crew it was gifted to me by the brand i'm also wearing this really fun white t-shirt under it um it's from tosin tosin also gifted and then i've got this fun necklace also from j crew wearing that today these jeans are a goldie i love them high rise you've got a thicker band and then they have that carrot thing going on with that wider leg i cuff them at the bottom just because i'm wearing them with flats so i'm wearing them with my prada dad sandals um just because if if i was wearing them with heels i wouldn't have done that but because they're a little shorter and then you have that you know lower um, heel it just looks better with the hem slightly shorter so I did that and it looks really fun so it's a casual cool I'm going to pick up my new car yay <laughs> I'll share that with you guys in a vlog but this is what I'm wearing I'm also carrying my Louis Vuitton Alma bag in this beautiful neon green yellowish color and yeah and this is the look casual comfortable cute and yeah my outfit for today also just doing hoops in terms of earrings arm candy keeping it nice and neutral I don't know if you can see that so we're keeping it nice and neutral and that's all I can think of <laughs> I gotta I have to run out too so but yeah um, style tip I guess with the cuff so if you want to rock this trend don't hesitate to cuff it if you feel like it feels or looks a little awkward um, scrunch up the sleeves on this just keeping it simple with the white on white um, and then the color so fun look easy to wear yay hey guys what's up welcome to another day another outfit um, today's outfit is you know a little chic um, but comfortable and casual I'm am re I'm running out of the house right now running well I, tr I always plan to get to places early, so I'm running a little late for my early arrival. So I'm gonna flip it around real, real quick and share with you guys. I'm going to the doctor's office, so I wanted to be comfortable. I wanted to put on things that I can, you know, obviously I'm doing checkups, whatever, so easy on, easy off, whatever. So I'm gonna flip it around and share the look. All right, so this is today's outfit of the day. Like I said, the goal um, with my look is comfortable, casual, easy to wear. I'm wearing this bodysuit from Banana Republic. Um, we've talked about these bodysuits um, in another haul, and they're just easy to wear. I love the colors. They come in um, a whole bunch of nudes and naturals, so in dark shades um, and the lighter shades. I picked lighter shades and dark shades because I figured, you know, I would want lighter nudes to kind of, you know, wear with outfits like this, so it works. I'm wearing my stirrups. They are self-portrait. I love them. Super high in the rise. Easy to wear. Comfortable. This blazer is Banana Republic. I really wish I got it in a bigger size. It's super old. It's, I think I, I was working with them when, they, or it was gifted, one of the two, but I think I was working with them. But um, love the blazer. Like I said, I wish I got it I wish I got in a bigger size now that oversized blazers are a trend, but this is just classic fitted. Um, I'm kind of making this a bit more on trend with my slides, my JW Anderson slides. You guys know I love these slides. I was originally going to wear my um, 
Gucci loafers, but I was like, ah, oh, these are just so much easier and they're on trend. I didn't want the look to be too classic and too, you know, chic, I guess. Well, not chic, but you know, just too classic. I wanted to put um, a stylish, you know, flair to it. So I did the slides. I'm wearing my Bottega um, pouch, has a crossbody. It's the mini size, which I love. There are hints of blue in this fabric. I don't know if you guys can see that. So I use that to kind of tie in the pouch. And yeah, the look works. Got my arm candy going on, a little bit of black in there, and some, some other options. You know, I talk about the arm candy in that arm candy video and just using color and other elements to pull things in. Um, earrings are just doing large hoops and trying to keep it simple. So this is the look. Casual, cool, simple. Now I gotta go. Almost forgot for sunglasses, wearing my Gucci oversized old classic, and I love them. And now this is the full look. <laughs> Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another outfit. Um, today's outfit is very comfortable, casual, and evoking spring. Um, I'm gonna flip it around and share it with you real quick um, because I'm about to jump on a call, so I'm gonna share it real quick before I jump on this call and then get out of here. Go. Okay, so today's look, I'm wearing this really cool t-shirt. It was gifted to me last year from MVP. Um, I, th I feel like I've um, shared a few of their pieces like in my hauls um, when they were sending me stuff last year. But anywho, this really cool t-shirt, I really love it. This is actually my first time wearing it now that we're in spring, spring. Let me take this off so you can see it. So it's just a fun, you know, it's got this really cool detail. And um, yeah, it's really fun. I really like it. I love the color. I love the fact that they have the logo in pink, which I think is a really cool detail as well. I'm wearing it with my A Goldie jeans. I've got my um, waist trainer under there, so it's a little bulky, but they look absolutely great on the bum. Great fit. They are a straight leg and hit right at the ankle. So it's a little awkward in my opinion in length. So I rolled up the hem twice so they frame my converse i also picked the converse because i feel like this type of jean frames a narrow leg so it's not narrow it's not um it's more of a straight leg it's not a boot cut this is a true straight leg and it is high in the rise it's not too high so just a great fitting jean that i have it was gifted i like it i really like the fit of them so i figured you know what i'd wear it with this look I did kind of a half tuck with the t-shirt, especially because of this kind of detail. So it sh frames my waist really well. It makes my look waist look a little bit more narrow. I think I've talked about this tip before. Just do a little bit of a tuck in the front and let your sides kind of frame your waist that way, or the center of your waist that way. It makes you look more narrow through the waist. Um, I'm wearing my pink Jacques Mousse bag to kind of complement that small pink detail there. We've got the Converse already, Arm Candy, doing some cool colors, so I've got my silver watch, and then my other anchor pieces to kind of, you know, emphasize more on that silver detail. And then we're doing the Fendi silver on one side, gold on the other. And that's it, keeping it somewhat simple, casual, comfortable, but always stylish. And, um, even though I'm wearing the bag has a shoulder bag, it's cute that way, but I, I'm always just more comfortable wearing it as a crossbody. However, I might just wear it as a shoulder bag because I didn't like the way it was crossing through um, the front of this t-shirt. And it's a really pretty t-shirt, so yeah, actually, I think I'll just wear it as a shoulder bag. All right, that's my look.
Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another day, another outfit. Um, today's outfit of the day is definitely very casual, cool. I am... I don't have any makeup on. I don't have any earrings or anything because I'm going for an event tonight and I wanted a clean face and then I would put on a full face of makeup. So I have a very clean face, but I'm at home and I'm still... If I'm correct, I'm still running out real quick. I'm meeting up with a friend, so I'll probably put some earrings on. I'll put some studs on, but keeping it very simple. But of course, you know, we still like to put on a very cute outfit. I'm wearing this tank top from Banana Republic. I absolutely love it. Gifted to me by the brand. Absolutely amazing fit. I also have it in gray, wearing the white today. And then this sweater, oversized sweater from Walmart. I've shared this sweater with you guys in a haul. Someone asked how will it, you know, wear after the wash. I've washed it, came out perfect. Um, scrunched up the sleeves. If I'm correct, I did this in a small. And then these cargo pants are from Zara. Little disappointed in the pants. Um, I don't mind the wrinkling because it's kind of like obviously I've been sitting down working all day. It's midday right now. I should have done this earlier, but it's midday. And um, I got a small, which was a good fit. I washed them and I feel like they shrank a little bit. I personally like my pants to be a little oversized but fitted through the waist. So I think that's why I went for this small instead of the medium because I did get both sizes and I ended up doing the small and now it's shrunk a little bit. So, But it still looks good with my Dior ID sneakers which I adore. Um, other than that, yeah, and I'm wearing it lower than I should be wearing it because it's supposed to be high rise but I'm wearing it lower. So I guess the style tip, if you have a great pair of pants that you absolutely love, but shrink in the wash, and they're high rise, just wear them a little lower. With this sweater, I kind of did a half tuck, um, so it can kind of fold over, and then I can wear it low like this, and it still works. Um, yeah, and, it, and you can still make it work, so don't feel like you have to get rid of something immediately. There's always a way to make, you know, an article of clothing that you love work. In terms of a bag, I'm doing my Yusefi bag, which I just feel like I don't wear it enough. And it's such a cute, fun bag. And it's a great, you know, price point too. If I'm correct, it's in the three, four hundreds. So good price point, entry, lux luxury entry price point, if that's a thing. But yeah, anywho, this is the look. I'm also wearing my Chanel I AirPod case holder. I keep on calling it iPod, but it's AirPod. AirPod case holder and then these sunglasses are Chloe. They're great because they're clear so I can see but at the same time they kind of cover my face so on days like I don't have makeup on or I don't want to wear makeup I always tend to wear glasses like this because you know they kind of cover your face and they make your face look interesting even though you have absolutely no makeup on. So yeah this is my look. Oh, arm candy. I'm also not doing a lot of arm candy. I don't know why I'm in a funky mood today even though today's going to be a fun day but I'm doing my watch your um doing my watch do your cufflink and just this clear bracelet to kind of complement the overall you know vibe of this outfit which is you know more of a neutral beige kind of have that monochromatic look going on um yeah and i'm here for it i love it this is a great example of a high low outfit we've got walmart we've got banana republic we've got j crew the yusefi is you know mid-range and then we've got the expensive sneakers so and the glasses well the glasses were expensive when i got them but I don't even think they're available now, but there's so many similar looks, so yeah. And I'll find similars. I'll link everything that's available, and um, if there's anything similar, I will, or if anything's sold out, rather, I'll link it. Yay. Ignore the mess that is my office, guys. Yes. <laughs> guys, what's up? Welcome to another outfit, another day. Um, today's look is fun. This the weather here is just really confusing. The other day it was 80 degrees, then yesterday it was like in like 67, 70. Today it feels freezing, um, and it's up and down. Anywho, I still have a, I'm still in a spring state of mind. Um, today I need to I'm going to two places basically. Right now I'm about to leave the house real quick to go to UPS. Got to send something. Oh, I sold I sold a few of my bags and there's a lot of messages. I'm actually afraid to get to everything, but yes, I'm going to ma uh, mail out one of the bags that I sold. So I'm going to UPS. Um, so for that, 
I'm wearing one particular pair of shoes, just an easy throw on, which I'll share with you. And then I'm supposed to be meeting up with a girlfriend who's in town. She wants to pick up a dress, so I'm supposed to meet up with her. And I'll show you which shoes I will wear if I decide, if I end up meeting up with her, depending on how much work I get done. So I'm gonna flip it around, share both options. It's one look, but just two different shoe options, which, you know, kind of changed the look a little bit. So yeah, let's flip it around. All right, so here is the look at a glance. Um, I am doing these shorts from the Banana Republic Prep Curry collection. You guys have seen that in one of my vlogs and I shared some other pieces in my last outfit of, of the day if I'm correct. They sent me um, two sets, so two full looks and some other pieces, but yeah, these shorts are really cute. Um, I'm wearing it with this t-shirt. This was gifted to me by, I can't remember the name of the brand. Let me double check. Tosin, Tosin NY. I hope I said that right. Um, anywho, t-shirt is amazing. I love white pieces, shirts, t-shirts, anything white I love because I just feel like they just create a very chic, very sleek, and they're the perfect base for any outfit it does a great job of complementing color it adds a level of just I feel like elegance really to any look so I love getting really dressy t-shirts this one is really really nice you've just got the the cap sleeve and then there's actually a zipper at the back so um yeah it's a really great t-shirt fabrics amazing anywho wearing it with this look I've got my waist trainer under it um but yeah, it's kind of, you know, it's not obvious, whatever. Blazer. Blazer is super old. It was gifted to me a long time ago by Another Stories. I haven't worn it in a minute, but I refuse to get rid of it. Um, and I'm happy I didn't because it's just, the, the silhouette is still very relevant. Um, I love it. It looks great. I wore this a few New York Fashion Weeks ago, um, and it's still just a great piece. Um, and it looks great with the shorts. The short has the shorts have hints of orange, so it just it works. I love it. Like I said, I'm running to go to FedEx, which is like five minutes, less than five minutes from my house. Literally, not FedEx, UPS. Sorry, <laughs> it's less than five minutes from my house. So I'm wearing my JW at, um, Anderson Mules slides, and you know it's still a casual, fun, you know look, which I'm here for. I love it got my Fendi hoops on um, just to add a little bit of interest Loewe bag you have some of these brown hues in the shorts as well um, the slides are casual but it doesn't take away from the look it definitely makes the outfit a little bit more casual but it still complements the outfit which I love um, what else with this outfit uh, arm candy um, doing a lot of stuff making it fun uh, my earrings are gold and silver, so, you know, the gold, the silver pieces, they all work together. You know, I talked about this in my arm candy video, your anchors, um, my, um, <laughs> David Yerman bracelet, um, just pulls in that silver really well, or pulls in other gold pieces, because we have dominantly silver pieces here with the watch and the bracelets, so, and then I'm also doing the Dior Friendship bracelets I'm doing the colorful one but I'm doing both of them because I'm just in a really fun mood my arm candy reflects my mood today I've got um, just the smaller Dior cuff on the other hand and yeah that's it this is the look to run out so I'm gonna show you with the shoes that I would wear um, when I'm going out later on all right so when I go out um, to help my girlfriend pick out a dress I would wear I will be wearing my Converse just because I just I love these shoes I just feel like they are probably the most versatile shoe complement anything and any everything and anything they're worn with so this is what I will be wearing walking around also if I decide to do dinner tonight I would probably wear my um, Bottega mules with this look but you know just for a day walking around um, I would definitely wear my Converse sneakers and yeah, and this would be the look fun Comfortable easy to wear um, Springy and I love it. 
Yay. Ignore that pile. Those are the other bags I'm selling. All right, guys, so I have the husband here for today's outfit of the day. We're both wearing the Banana Republic prep curry pieces. So they sent me some pieces and they um, were so gracious to send my husband some pieces. So he's got his head to toe, well, not head to toe, but like the suit and then Reebok sneakers, which Reebok also sent him a pair, which I love. Um, for me, this is uh, from the collection. I did speak to Banana Republic, their reps, and unfortunately, they're not reproducing it, but they said there's some pieces available at like their LA store and some pieces online. So I'll put the link in the description box. So, you know, if you guys want to check it out, definitely. But wearing the hoodie, wearing these white jeans, they are Curran and Elliott. I don't even know if that brand still exists, but they're super old. Got my trusty sneakers from my, um, whatchamacallit, uh, Converse platform sneakers, Loewe bag, Chanel, AirPod case holder, um, and then just wearing these glasses. Um, but I guess for this look, uh, don't hesitate to wear your white jeans, you know? Doesn't matter what time of the year it is, what not, so. But I'm loving this oversized hoodie kind of vibe. Um, I would say when you're wearing something that's this big and bulky, you definitely want to wear something a bit more tailored or more fitted on the bottom. These crop jeans are fitted on top but loose and then I just roll them up just a little bit so they can frame my um, sneakers really well and it's cold outside so I'm wearing socks. So yeah, this is the look, casual, comfortable, and husband's look. <laughs> Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another day, another outfit. I am currently clearly losing my voice. <laughs> um, I did some um, videos, so I've been talking a lot, but losing my voice. Anywho, today's outfit's really fun. I have makeup on, normally I don't, be, but I have makeup on today because I did some shoots. Um, but I need to do some mommy stuff. I gotta take my kids to Kumon, so I'm gonna Flip it around, share today's look. All right, so I have been up since 5 a.m. Had to get ready for the shoot, had to do the shoot, finish getting ready, um, took the kids to school back. It's been a long day, I am tired. Um, so now I have tons of work to do, tons of emails to literally respond to. So I put on this look because I wanted to be comfortable even though I have to go, I went out and I actually still have to go out again. I wanted to be cute, of course, but I wanted to be very comfortable. So I am wearing this knit dress. You guys must, you sh I'm sure you remember it. It was in um, Zara Hall, it's from Zara. Absolutely love this dress, love the color. When I originally bought it, I thought it was lilac, but it's more on the blue side. But it's just a fun, easy to wear, very, very comfortable dress. I am not wearing a bra with it, it's ribbed, so I feel like you can get away with that, um, depending on your bust. I'm also wearing a oversized cardigan. This one is from Walmart. I work with Walmart all the time. This is from their free assembly collection, which I adore, super comfortable. This is probably like the fourth wash and I just feel like it's great. I actually have like rubber bands holding up the strap because it was falling down and I just wanted to be like, not have to bother or fuss with anything. I just wanted to throw it on. I'm wearing it with like a half button kind of off the shoulders. I don't know, I like wearing it this way. I just feel like it's fun and it makes it more interesting and I'm just very comfortable. Um, earrings, doing my Fendi logo, one silver, one gold on this side. Love these earrings bag i'm wearing my chanel 19 in yellow i just love this bag it's easy to wear um has a crossbody. it just really keeps everything in place too when i wear it this way so i love wearing it as a crossbody. shoes we did well we <laughs> i'm wearing my um dior id sneakers i love these sneakers they look great with absolutely everything um and they just do a great job of complementing the sweater and the overall look so this is the look, gotta run out to take these kids to Kumon. Um, but yeah, this is what I've been wearing for the rest of the day and my fun wig. <laughs> Yay.
all right guys there you have it another outfit of the day which outfit was your favorite let me know with your dis <laughs> let me know with your comments below um as always i appreciate you guys tuning in don't forget to subscribe if this is your first time um also don't forget to check me out on instagram it's odd by Monty, as well as tiktok odd by Monty. thank you so much for watching the video thank you so much for liking the video giving it that is it a two thumbs up no it's a heart whatever it is thank you for doing that <laughs> and until next time bye guys <laughs>